Hello and welcome to the GetTotalWealth.com video podcast where I constantly bring you members and really team members as well as members of Total Wealth Academy that I'm, my guest today is both I'll explain something else he's doing that's different from a normal <laughs> guest in just a moment but uh, that are on the path to financial independence or building that second stream of income up to their goal and the neat thing about Donnie who's here with me today is he's not only investing he's helping other people invest as well including talking people who are scared to death off of the ledge and getting them to take action yeah. and get their deal so yeah please uh welcome donnie gothard to the show thank you he's with verity mortgage you can mm -hmm. find him online at veritymortgage.com and let's start off by talking about your por portfolio and what you're doing to build wealth and income tell me about that we'll call it a house hack deal that you described yeah, on the radio yeah. show. So basically, um, I was in the position to where I wanted to move my office and up popped a deal on a house in Sealy where one of my offices was. And behind that house, part of the property was three efficiency units that all came with it. And uh, those three units based on the rents coming in is $2,150. And I'm renting the house as my office to the company for another 1350 Wow. So my positive cash flow was over $900 a month after all bills paid, taxes, insurance, everything. $900 a month, positive cash mm -hmm. flow, and you bought it for 400 What was it worth the day you closed? The day I closed, it appraised for 565 Man. And that's not doing any work to it. It was fully functional at the time. $165,000 equity pickup yep. instantly. instantly. Your net worth went up. $165,000. Yep. And I will be doing that presentation for you at the next time you have me in, and I'll actually bring the appraisal numbers and everything with me. Man, that's awesome. Um, yeah, that may be next month because I'm excited about this yeah. deal enough to get it, <laughs> push it really forward. Nice. Um, the next thing is tell the story about the guy who was kind of scared. Yeah, yeah the, the guy on the ledge. So had a buyer who we pre-approved a very – long while back and he'd come to us probably three or four times to get his approval updated and just never bought anything so understand the approval is good for 90 days so every 90 days he had been coming in and coming in so after about a year went by i finally said okay come on what what's holding you back why have you not pulled the trigger and he took flat out told me he said i'm scared he says i just i just can't do it and i said well what do you want me to do to help you? And he said, you tell me, give me the advice. So I said, fine, I'll call you back. So what I did was I went out and found a house with decent numbers, um, got a contractor in there to give me a bid. Um, and it was a local contractor to the property. So I knew they were close by, um, had the appraiser look at it, gave me a value, plugged all the numbers together, called him, said, okay, you're buying this house. And he's like, okay. So he bought the house, rehab the house, and, you know, and I'd explain to him, my office is right down the street. I'll go over and keep an eye on it, help you through it. We'll meet there and walk it and stuff like that. So bought the house, rehab the house, refinance it to permanent loan, and now he's making 400 bucks a month positive cash flow. His total out-of-pocket was 3900 and some change. Okay. Now, people, do the math on that. He's making $4,800 a year. Mm -hmm. He only put up. 4,000. 4, I think that's a 120% rate yep. of return. Yep. And what the viewer needs to ask themselves is what rate of return am I getting? You know, the stock market has averaged over the last 75 years, 7%. Mm -hmm. And we're making literally hundreds of percent rate of return in some cases. Yep. You have an infinite rate of return on your deal. How much down was that uh, $400,000 deal? Zero. Zero. And you're making $900. That's yep. an infinite rate, rate of so return. So basically, I bought the house using hard money, even though it didn't need any rehab, and then immediately refinanced it into my permanent financing. So I was able to use that equity position to work for me. So, so the viewer needs to ask themselves, how many houses can I buy for zero down? How many houses can I buy, buy for 4000 down? down? Exactly. And you can create a portfolio yeah. in a very short All day period long. of time. Mm -hmm. So... Tell us about the type of loans. You've got a deal where you're 100% financed. On the front end, yes. Yeah, so basically, if you've got a house that needs to be rehabbed, um, you can come to us and we'll loan you 100% of sales price, rehab, and closing costs. 
Now, normally, your your lenders will only loan you up to seventy five percent of the ARV up front. Right. Okay. Well, we loan you one hundred percent of everything. So if that number sales price where you have been closing costs goes over that same five percent number, we don't care. We're going to loan you one hundred percent. The only thing out of pocket is the appraisal. And that's because it's a third party, and we have to do that. Okay. We also, which no one else does, and we talked about this earlier. I will give you 50% of your rehab money up front. So you're not out of pocket that either to get started. So most of the people charge that. We don't. And then what we do is. Everybody I know charges that. And then at the refi stage, we refinance you based on the government guidelines of 75% of the after repaired value. So it helps limit your out of pocket. Yeah. And people need to understand in a normal deal, let's say your total out of pocket was 20 grand. Mm Mm-hmm. And your rehab was fifty grand. Well, you would have to come up with the twenty grand and twenty five thousand. But with you, you'll give them the twenty five thousand mm-hmm. out of that loan. Yep. To get the contractor and no started. money out of pocket on the purchase. Yeah, it's amazing, amazing. So, what other types of loan do you do? You even do owner? I'm sorry, owner Owned, occupant. Owner yeah. occupant. Yeah, we'll do loans for your primary residences. We'll do loans for your second homes. You know, your vacation houses. Um, we'll do loans for you know USDA, VA, FHA, blah 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 blah, all the way up to a four unit property. Um, we do everything except land loans. Yeah, no non. It's got to be an income producing asset mm-hmm. or a personal residence. Yep. So okay, and if you want to find, if they want to reach out to you, yes. Uh, let's get that email and the phone. Let's get the phone number out because yeah. Verity Mortgage they can get a hold of you there. Yes. Dot com. So we've got several. Uh, options for you. You can call me at the office at 832-975-1800. That's 832-975-1800. Or you can call, uh, text me on my cell, 832-489-1011. That's 832-489-1011. And then the email uh, is donald.gothard at Verity mortgage.com spell or, verity because yeah of, verity mortgage.com yeah i think a lot of people can just go there and find you yeah verity mortgage.com um it's spelled v is in victory e-r-i-t-y mortgage.com and the important thing that i brought up on the radio show that i forgot to bring up and i want to is there's so many people out there with mm-hmm. mortgage brokers who have never done a real estate investment deal exactly and i do it constantly yeah. Sooner or later, they're going to do something dumb Mm -hmm. or they're going to burn you in one way. They don't even mean to. They just don't know because they've never owned rental real estate. You need somebody on your team like you who actually owns it, is doing the same thing you're doing, and you're going to win more times than you would with, with, say, and I hate to put down any particular bank, but if you go to Wells Fargo and talk to, they don't know anything Mm -hmm. about investment real estate at all. All right. Well, I really appreciate it, Donnie. Thank you so much for coming out. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right. Thanks, everybody, for watching, and have a great rest of your day. Bye-bye.